Astros starting lineup. Inside at the four and five, it's Sohan and Wimbanyama. Jones and Vassell are the one and the two. And it's Johnson in at the three spot. And for Phoenix, a Kogi and Durant, they're the forwards. The deadly duo of Beal and Bucker at the one and the two. And it's Nurkic in at the five. And remember, Grant, tonight is game two of this two-game regular season series. How do you like these? You know, I love them. I mean, they're really interesting. The NBA significantly increased playing the same team in back-to-back -back games a couple years ago. Of course, it limits travel, but it makes for great games, almost like a mini playoff series of sorts. The shot by Johnson, no good. And so Beal will bring it up for Phoenix. Coming into this, having notched a win against San Antonio in their last game. And it was really their defense that got them the win. They had a plan scripted out, and it worked to perfection. Well, good defensive game plan, and then carrying it out for 48 minutes. That really helped them out in that last game. Jones, the pass to Sohan. Now with Midyama. Vassell, outside. To the inside. Outside Jones. Five on the clock. Here's Sohan. Bradley Beal puts it in. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. Oh, it's blocked by Wimbanyama. With great mobility in the eight-foot wingspan. Yes, eight-foot. Wimbanyama easily wipes that shot away. And he creates such a great opportunity right at the rim, and he just can't get it to go, even with the defense not really a factor. Now here's Johnson. They really needed more from him in that loss to Phoenix. Out to the right wing. Spurs need to get one up here. Here's the cell. That three's off the mark. So disruptive defensively out beyond the arc. Yeah, you gotta like how he hustled to guard out on the perimeter, definitely respecting the shooting ability. Grant, usually the Suns rack up lots of assists. They're a team that values ball movement. Oh, B.A., that's how you create quality looks, by snapping the ball around. It also tells you something about how selfless these guys Trey are. Jones. And the lid's off. Uh, they're one for four to begin this one, but that shot might just get them going. Booker, pass to Durant. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. From the low block. That won't go. Misses his first shot of the game. The Spurs have gone one of four to begin this one. Pass to Sohan. And here's Wimbanyama, guarded by Duran. Outside Jones. Here's Sohan. Takes the three. And he's in the Jeremy books. Now one Sohan. for two. And three that's what they goal. want to do. Get him open looks early. The Suns trailing. First quarter of play, and we're about three minutes in. Here's Beal to the paint. Here's Okogi, covered by Johnson. Good work there as it goes. San Antonio has gone one of two from three-point land so far. Here's Jones. That one no good. Beal with some nice D. And so it's Beal who brings up the ball for the Phoenix Suns. Sohan with a rebound. For San Antonio, they've gone two of six to open up this game. Beal against Jones. Here's Wimbanyama. Count it. One for one to start the game. Yeah, terrific follow through from Wimbanyama, proving he has a good head on his shoulders. They need something time good to happen Phoenix, here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Phoenix calls timeout. Well, it's not hard to get excited about what Wimbanyama could potentially bring to the league, Grant. Yeah, yeah. I mean, possibly some of the biggest hype we've seen, V.A. Unreal ball skills at 74. And he's got that drive to be the greatest. Phoenix making some changes. Eubanks, he's checked in for Nurkic. Bowl comes in for Durant. And it's Gordon in for a Kogi. Now here's Beal. 
He's coming off a 10-point uh, game against San Antonio. San Antonio well, Bradley Beal has a few yeah, nicknames for him. Here's a new one, though. Mr. Consistent. Well, let's say yes, B.A. But when healthy, he struggled Bradley the past couple Beal. years with that. But let's face it, when Bradley Beal plays, this guy is a tremendous two-guard who can score in bunches, defend, and win games all by himself. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for him. You know, Grant, last season for the Spurs, their worst winning percentage since 1997. And for a franchise that's done so much winning, B.A., kind of strange to see. I mean, four straight years missing the playoffs, but before that, 22 straight playoff appearances and five titles. And he makes both free throws. You know, Brent, for the Suns franchise, it's hard to believe they've never won an NBA title. Pretty incredible with the uh, ring of honor in Phoenix that they have and the amount of Hall of Fame players that have put on that jersey. And they've lost the finals a few exactly. times, up 2-0 back in the 21 finals. They've had a couple of MVPs, some fantastic teams. The title is the last frontier for the Phoenix Suns. Here's Booker after the basket by San Antonio. Eubanks, the pass to Gordon. Pass to Beal. From downtown, drops in the three. Beal's got five now. Got to get out on Beal. He's just too dangerous as an outside shooter. Now Grant. Collins with it. Puts up a three. It's hauled in by the Suns. Beal's got four rebounds in the game. Pass to Gordon. There's 49 seconds left in the first quarter. Now Beal. Over Grant. Gets it to drop. Now two to four. Defenses have to know that Bradley Beal is thinking score. This time he does it from the mid-range. Beal against Graham. Shoots over Beal. Graham misses. <laughs> Let's be honest. That's not a shot he should be taking. No, he, he should know better. He knows that's not his game, which is why we don't see him take that shot off. Booker. San Antonio with a rebound. They couldn't put the pieces together, losing that last matchup with Phoenix. Yeah, it was really just the failure to convert shots on a consistent basis. <laughs> That's going to cost you games, believe me. Well, the defense against them had a little something to do with it. You still got to go out there. You got to find a way to get good looks. You got to keep working the system. And quite frankly, they just couldn't do that. At the line for two. Good on that one. Can't get either to fall. Well, a good close contest so far as we finish the first quarter. The Suns on top. They're up by two. Stay with us now as we get set to bring you quarter number two after this. And if you're just joining us, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And take a look at the Suns' performance here, guys. What are your thoughts? 
Well, you have to credit their effort on the defensive end. It set the tone for this contest. That defense has been infectious here as everybody stepping up aggressively on that end. And so Beal will bring it up for the Sun. Kogi and Durant, they're the forwards. Eric Gordon is out there with Bradley Beal. And it's Metu in at the five spot. That's who's out there for Phoenix. Now here's Gordon. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Well, Graham, before he even hit the league, Wimbanyama was touted as the next big star from the farm. You know, B.A., playing in a foreign pro league added to his mystique, B.A. We weren't getting the exposure to his game. It made it easy to wonder just how great he would be here. And so here's Phoenix. The Spurs making their last shot. Here's Gordon. Pass to Okogi. Clock at six. Fires top of the key. It's hauled in by Wimbanyama. Not a bad shot from the mid-range. The D's giving it to him, and he's usually got an eye in that kind of range. Vassell can't get it to go. Whew, I think he wants that one back. I mean, he knows he's capable of better. Here's Durant. Offensive rebound. Durant owning the inside. Rank helping KD there. He just slinks around the paint, waiting patiently. Here's Vassell. Pass to Collins. Fires from deep. Second chance shot. Well, Kogi pulls down the board. Yeah, better than giving up the layup. You want to go in there and use the hard foul. They did it there. That's an aggressive attitude defensively. And that was just moving the ball quickly. And he's rewarded at the end with the high percentage throw. Yeah, the defense trying to do their best to slow him down. But when he gets room like that, you got to look out. Here's Johnson following the score by Phoenix. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. And you can't leave the basket unprotected. Bad things will happen to you. Yeah, that was just way too easy will not find a higher percentage opportunity than that. A chance here to catch up with Ali from the sideline. Well, B.A. Victor Wembanyama was asked to describe his game, and he said, quote, the word I would say is versatile. Being able to score at any level, any moment in the game, Fierce. taking responsibilities, maybe Mr. Do Everything. And Brian, will he be the next international phenom to take over the league? He said with a smile, I'm sure of it. Ah, plenty of confidence right there. Good stuff, Alec. Thank you for that. Now a timeout called by Phoenix. Grant is someone whose career spanned eras. You feel playing defense is more difficult than it was two decades ago? Oh, B.A., it's much more difficult. In part, because the contact allowed is much more strict. Shooters can create contact and be rewarded with free throws. And the skill level on offense has truly raised. It makes it tough for the defender to really get down and play that tough nose defense. The Spurs have gotten just two of six field goals to go in the second. On the wing, Jones. And here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. Nurkic with some nice D. For Phoenix, they've gone three for seven here in the second quarter. Durant against Johnson. Durant, pass to Beal. Doesn't go for him. Good D by Wimbanyama. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. The cells shot is good. Vassell. And when wings take it down low, good things happen. The Suns leading. Oh, Grant, it seems like just yesterday that the Spurs were drafting a generational big man. <laughs> of all the places for Wimby to go, the Spurs were ideal. It continues the line of elite talents to play under Pop. He'll learn from the best. Oh, yes, sir! Oh, wow. Wow. The assist. And good patience from Johnson to wait for his man to open up. There's the AT&T 5G slam cam capturing the moment. Two minutes remaining. Gordon on the wing. He's Two guarded by Vassell. Here's Beal. And the step back jumper is good. Beal's got his third bucket of the night. 
such a critical part of how their offense is going to flow. Things are only working when he seems to be on the floor. Time call here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. Trying anything now to get them out of this slump. Well, they can't find the net right now. All they need, I think, is just to get one to go, get back on track. Phoenix making some changes. Bull comes in for Nurkic. And it's Booker in for Beal. A big group substitution here for San Antonio. Massey, he's checked in for Victor Wimbanyama. Osman comes in for Johnson. Branham's checked in for Vassell. And Devontae Graham is subbed in for Jones. Graham, the pass to Bassey. Here's Osman. Outside Graham. There's the triple. Gordon pulls it in. And Gordon has got the ball here for the Phoenix Suns. Booker for three. Bassey pulls it in. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Here's Graham. And that one is on target from the wing. Assisted by Graham's got his first two points of the night. Well, we know one thing. Devontae Graham is not going to turn down any shooting opportunity. For three, Booker. Sohan with a rebound. Sohan's got four rebounds now. Pass to Graham. Over to the wing. Here's Branham. Defended by Gordon. Oh, it's blocked by Bull. And he recovers it. Here's Durant. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. One of the things you've got to admire about Kevin Durant is his ability just to continue to focus on playing basketball. This guy is a true hooper. Well, Durant is at the point of his career where we can discuss if he's one of the best ever. I don't think that you could argue that. He certainly has all of the accolades, B.A., All-Stars, titles, Take a break. MVPs, Take a break. finals MVPs. On that 75th anniversary team, just stack them all up. He's right there. Free throw is good from Durant. The Phoenix Suns have proved that one smart trade can make a big impact, Brent. Now, B.A., I'm, I'm going to challenge you here. Is it smart to put Kevin Durant on your team? Of course it is. I mean, that's a blockbuster deal. The franchise went for it. They grabbed the talent. They grabbed one of the best players of all time to join this core to see if they could push themselves to an NBA championship. And both free throws good for Durant. A big fellow with the ability and confidence at the free throw line is something that every team wants. You don't have to make those late substitutions. Keep your big guys on the floor. Six second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Bassey, still without a bucket. Here's Branham. The offensive rebound. Pass to Graham. Here's the three. It's not going to go for him. And a pretty tight and contested game here as we end the first half. Suns ahead, leading by just two. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks a lot. I'm with Frank Vogel and Coach. What's going to be critical in the second half to get this win? Just be us. Okay, we got to go on the three-point line, keep him off the free-throw line, make him make contested twos. we got to move the basketball offensively. Your expectations are always high defensively. Thank you, Coach. Appreciate it, Allie. And we'll be coming right back after this break, ready for the third quarter. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey again, everybody. I'm Ernie Johnson. Shaq is here. Kenny's here. You're watching the NBA Halftime Show on 2K Sports. For the Suns, the first quarter was pretty even. And in that period, the most they trailed by was three. Scoring-wise, they broke even in the second, so little ground was lost there. Kenny, let's start with you. What did you think about the Suns? This is what the home fan loves to see. Their squad coming out and putting together strong. We'll see a couple individuals stand out. But what really stand out is how hard they work and how they're playing together. Shaq, what did you see from San Antonio? It's been tough sledding for them. Reminds me of my uh, under 35. They need better execution if they want to create high-quality looks. It's going to take a team effort. We'll see if they're up. 
That's all for now. Say goodbye to the folks. Thanks goodbye, for folks. joining us. Third quarter, just about ready to begin. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. Hey, it's been quite a game for Bradley Beal. Through two quarters of play, he's been an excellent source of points. Yeah, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during halftime. So on the floor for the Spurs. Johnson is at the three with Sohan down at the four. Jones and Vassell are the one and the two. And it's Wimbanyama in at the five, roaming the paint. Back to Jones. Another shot. Oh, Nurkic with the block. Nurkic big and blocking. Durant, pass to Booker. Here's Beal. And he banks in the layup. Beal's got 11. Oh, a great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Well, just ripping through right there as he finds the open spot and gets right through there. High basketball IQ play. Goes back up. Women Yama, no good. Might be time for the coaching staff to bust out a play for him to get going. Both for four to start the half. Durant's shot is off. The Spurs have gone 0 for 4. Not the way they want to start the second half. Here's Vassell. Here's Wimbanyama. And that one's good. Wimbenyama. Nice job on the glass as they picked up two on the second effort. <laughs> there were questions about Wimbanyama's strength coming into the league. No problem with the contact here. Durant, the pass to Okogi. Six points for him. When he decides he wants to take it to the bucket, it's really hard for anyone to slow him down. Outside Jones. A good look from Johnson. Phoenix grabs the miss. Well, he wants that one over again, I guarantee that. Nobody's even in the neighborhood. The cell against Booker. Ooh, the slam! Get up there! Big time slam from Booker, showing off his athleticism. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. You could say the Spurs are in development mode. Devin Vassell said there's a lot of potential, a lot of new opportunity. Sounds Just got to make sure we're growing each game and maturing. As long as we play together and we play the right way, we will have a chance to win every game. We still have the greatest coach of all time sitting back there. Right? Yeah, you'll get no argument here. Thanks, Allie. And the Suns making a change here. Matthews checked in. Well, we're into the third quarter, just over two and a half minutes played. You know, Grant, looking back to the Spurs' tough last season, free throw shooting was something they pointed to. You know, B.A., it's San something Antonio they have to correct. They didn't get to the line enough, and the percentage foul. wasn't good First when they foul. did. And, of course, At that's the line for a Phoenix. bad combination. Bradley Beal. Oh, Grant, Beal traded over the last summer to Phoenix. A new start for him. Yeah, and Beal was the guy for so long with the Wizards. And now he's part of a deadly trio. And, you know, his numbers, B.A., might drop, but the wins should be much more hmm. plentiful. Free throw drops for Beal. You know, Grant, thinking back to those 2021 finals, the Suns coming so close to their first championship. Think about it, B.A. Phoenix had a 2-0 lead over the Bucks, but Giannis then decided to take over. And still, I think that taste of the finals was great for Devin Booker and the Suns. Both good from the line that time. That's what he does. Rock solid at the line. 
Now here's Jones. Pass to Sohan. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. First personal foul. First team foul. Shooting for San Antonio. Sohan at the line for two. good Gordon he's checked in for Bradley Beal and San Antonio with a change here too Graham's checked in and so he hits both and Booker's got the ball here for the Phoenix Suns they lead by four over Graham and it's in after a nice bounce off the right there. Booker's gotten four this quarter. Well, defensively, they've been flat in this second half. A very different type of team than we saw in the first. Here's Sohan. And Metu pulls it down. Third quarter action. Just under three and a half minutes have passed. Here's Gordon. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. And after a sketchy first half, they're now looking much more comfortable in the offensive end. The Spurs shooting a low 31%. Their offense is lacking. Graham, the pass to Wimbanyama. Not going to go that time. Nurkic with some nice D. It hasn't been his best quarter. I mean, he's trying to shoot himself out of a slump. Count that one. And now a 10-point Suns lead. Can't fault the D entirely on that two bucket from Gordon, although the coach will. Sometimes he's just too good for whatever you throw at him. Outside Johnson. It's hauled in by the Suns. And this feels like it's snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. Booker no good. It's not his best night from the field, but looking for other ways and finding them so he can chip in. Johnson passes to Wimbanyama. Okogi pulls down the board. Okogi's got his fourth rebound in this one. What balance from Booker. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. On offense, here is San Antonio. San Antonio Down by 12. The They'll be hosting Toronto for their next one. And that's a one-game homestand for the club. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. They're just giving away a run right now. The question is, can they stop the tie? It's hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. Phoenix making some changes. Eubanks, he's checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Bowl comes in for Metu. And it's Bradley Beal in for Gordon. A big group substitution here for San Antonio. Collins, he's checked in for Wimbledon. Bassey comes in for Sohan. Osman, he's checked in for Johnson. And Branham subbed in for Vassell. Here's Collins. Outside Graham. Six to shoot. Like the defense from Beal doing whatever he could to alter that one. And they'll get another chance. Bassey. Oh, persistence Bassey. pays off as they finally Persistent. hit a shot. Bassey's got his first bucket in this one. That's the kind of passing you want there. Work the ball around, keep it moving, try to get an assist on every bucket. Here's Beal. Scholar foul. Jenny Osman. Second personal foul. Second team foul. Down low. It's blocked! It's Graham on the wing. We've got 22 seconds left in the third quarter. Just five on the clock. Little turnaround. That went a little long. 
Probably not the shot that was drawn up for that possession, but you can't pass it up and you can't knock it down. Yeah, here's Beal. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First personal foul. Third and Beal foul. makes a great selection there. He commits to that. Physical defense is not going to take him out of the way, and he draws the foul. Free throw drops for Beal. And Bradley Beal, another indicator of him doing a little bit of everything for this team. That one's no good. So it's Phoenix closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Defense is setting the tone. Back after this. 27. And while we have a chance, let's go to our State Farm assist to the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Well, a great job with the eyes. And what separates great playmakers, as we know, is peripheral vision. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works, or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. The deadly duo of Beal and Bucker at the one and the two. Kevin Durant is out there with Bull Bull, and it's Eubanks in at the five, down low. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Suns. Brandon misses. It's not easy to finish in traffic, but those are chances he has to convert. And that one's good. Bull. Like a manager. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. Yeah, feels like Christmas right now, just gift wrapping points. Jones, the pass to Bassey. Here's Branham. Eubanks defending to the middle. Jones against Beal. Jones misses. Perfect timing to rise up and challenge the shot inside. Yeah, not easy to do there, and that's a guy that you can tell takes every possession defensively very seriously. Here's Durant. Knocks it loose. And that one's good. Oh, oh beating everyone to the ball. Great activity on the offensive glass. The Spurs have gone 0 for 3 in this fourth. Not good. Pass to Bassey. Johnson on the wing. And just about a minute and a half gone by in the fourth. Ooh, Durant with some nice D. Bull finds Durant. San Antonio with a rebound. Bassey's got rebound number five here tonight. They're searching for a way to score. Yeah, buckets have been very tough to come by. Beal against Johnson. The shot, no good. Nice D from Beal. The Suns have gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Outside Booker. And then Beal with the knock. On top of just flat out scoring, Booker can really pick apart defenses. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk over. They're giving up a lot of points in the paint. That's something they have to address here. Yeah, coach knows that. They know that. In the timeout, they're going to hear about it. Make the, the adjustment. Free teachers. Some changes for Phoenix. Yusuf Nurkic, he's checked in for Eubanks. And Okogi is subbed in for Durant. And the Spurs making a change here. 
We're in the fourth quarter here. Just under two and a half minutes gone by. Jones, the pass to Wambanyama. Vassell, outside. Shot clock at six. To snap the cold streak. And it's Wimbanyama laying it in. Yeah, the control from Wimby. I mean, this guy is unreal. Booker surveying the D. Pass to Beal. Shot from the wing. They grab their own miss. And that one's good. Oh, oh has got six here in the quarter. And force feeded the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. To the right side. Wimanyama against Nurkic. Wimanyama, no good. The Suns have gone four of seven from the field in the fourth quarter. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We've played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. Here's Booker. Nice D from Vassell. San Antonio shooting just around 26% for the game. Pass to Sohan. Jones against Beal. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. And even from where we're sitting, you could clearly tell it was a foul. And let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for the Suns. Well, not content to take what the defense gives them. I mean, they're attacking the gaps and getting the ball inside. You probably have to touch on as well that tonight their penetration has been awesome. I mean, they put force on this game, attacking off the bounce, and a willingness to do that has paid off. That's good from Jones. Durant, he's checked in for the Suns. Johnson, he's checked in for San Antonio. So he gets them both. And here are the Suns now. Deal with it. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. No luck on that one. Jones with some nice D. And so it's Jones who brings up the ball for San Antonio. They've given up just eight points in the fourth. Well, Phoenix is shooting 44% here in the fourth quarter. Hooker, pass to Durant. A minute 31 left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Sohan with a rebound. Sohan's got his seventh rebound here tonight. They came out and had a statement win with their performance tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Suns. And of course, they really dominated in the paint tonight. They obviously came in looking to impose their will, attack the heart and soul of that defense, and it led to a lot of good looks. And it's a performance that will signify their fifth win of the year. But once this game is all said and done, they'll have a healthy 2-0 lead in this season series. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for Bradley Beal. Anytime they needed a bucket, they'd put the ball in his hands and say, go make a play. It was impressive to watch. Nurkic against Wimbanyama. Nurkic passes to Akogi. Johnson with the defensive effort. Got to appreciate the aggressive defense he brings. Well, it's about the defensive end, and that's what guys feed off. He gives the effort down there at all times. Wimbenyama. And Wimbanyama gets it to go. Yeah, this is what everyone wants to see Wimbanyama doing. Dominating on the inside. Shot and game clock separated by five. Durant inside. Vassell with the rebound. Shoots over Booker. Vassell can't get it to go. Now Beal. So it's the Suns winning this one.